Visit us at Eduvo. Thank you for calling Eduvo. Welcome to this lecture. In this lecture, we are going to be see how to create the web browser in Java Swing. For that, I just import a library of java.awt. Then I just import another library of java.awt.event. Okay, now import javax.swing and then import java.net. For net, I just import this library. Uh, and then import java.input output. Now, here we have the class name which is web browser and now it's write private and j frame so j frame variable is frame now private and the private here is j panel so the panel is panel top now private j editor and now here I just write name which is editor okay and this is editor sorry it's editor pen private j is scroll pen and I just set the name which is scroll now again private j text field and now here I'll write field so private j button and now here I'll write button okay and private URL and it's a URL here now public and browser and the browser here is public web browser and it's a string of title okay now I just write initiate components and then I just write frame dot that title so I just set the title to my frame so which is title now I just set the default close on frame so frame dot that default on close operation and J frame dot exit on close now I just set the size of the frame so frame dot that size and the size there is 800 and 600 now I just add the J panel to the frame so frame dot add and border layout dot north and then I just write panel top so I just add this frame into the north layout now I just write panel which is top add so top dot add and add here is field so I just add this text field here okay so this text field and the navigation button to the J panel and this is panel top okay now frame dot add and add here is border layout dot center and then it's a scroll so I just add a scroll pan to the J frame center now I just set the frame visible so frame dot set visible and visible here is true now I just create the method to this initiate component so private and here I just write void in components okay 
to method to that one that one and now I just create the frame here so I just write frame which is equal to new J frame now panel top which is equal to new J panel so I just create the J panel to use hold the text field and the button okay now I just write means uh, after this panel I just set the URL so try and URL which is equal to new URL and here I just set the URL which is HTTP and HTTP s dot double dot and double backslash www dot google dot com so this is by default a text field means a URL now I just write catch to catch the exceptions so I just write mul formed and then URL exception which is MUE okay now I just write J option pan dot show message dialog and here I just write null which is MUE means this one as close this code here so I just close this code here and remove one string from here so null which is MUE and now we go to the means here we have our constructor area is closed here and then now I just create the J editor pan here so same I just write try editor which is equal to new J editor pan and here I just pass the URL now I just set the editor pen to the false editor dot set sorry it's editor dot set edit sorry editable and here I just write false okay so it's a editor like this one okay now I just catch this exception so input output exception and here I E I O E or you can simply write E okay so J option pan dot show message dialog and the components are null and E okay now I just create the scroll pan and add the J editor pan to it so a scroll pan which is equal to new J scroll pan and editor sorry editor dot J scroll pan dot so here I just write editor and then J scroll pan dot vertical scroll bar sorry I just did a mistake vertical scroll bar as needed when we need the scroll bar vertical so it will show us the scroll bar so scroll pan dot horizontal scroll bar as needed now I just write field which is equal to new field which is equal to new j text field and now I just set the j text field text to the URL and here I just write swing utilities 
and utility dot invoke later which is new and runnable now sorry it's new and runnable which is if one and here I just close this code and now I just write public void run okay and field dot set text and the text is URL dot to string okay so we are not doing this on the event dispatch thread so we need to use swing libraries only for that okay and here I just write I just create a button okay so and here close this code and I just create a button here now so button which is equal to new J button and the button I just write go URL okay now I just add the action listener to the button so button dot add action listener and the action listener is new action listener okay and it's new action listener and here I just write public void action performed and action event e okay and here I just write try and the try is editor dot sorry it's editor dot set and set is the page here so page is field dot get text okay and now catch catch is input output exception and which is exception is e and now j option pen dot show message box message dialog box which is null sorry which is null and e okay e is a exception here so our code is create closed here and then i just remove this code here and our initiate component area is closed now I just uh, give you one curly bracket here and now I just write public static void main and then string arguments so here I just write swing utilities dot invoke letter and new runnable and here I just write public void run and then new and the name of this web browser class and here I just paste the name of this web browser class and then I just write simple web browser and close this code here and close this code here and I just close this code here so this is the ending of the main area and this is the ending of the browser so swing utili utilities and here I just write swing and utilities and then here I just create or change it to the mult form 
and then editor change the name here and the swing utilities so create the constant to the swing utilities now i just check the code here so swing utilities here and editor and then swing and utilities okay now just check the output and this is the exception e e and here i just also write the exception e so i just run this code right now and here you can find the output of this code so google.com here you can see and now i just write here which is java.com or a udemy.com okay it's a java.com website and here udemy.com and right click on go so i just click on go but it is not go through the udemy.com website i don't know why but this is a simple example of web browser in java thanks for watching this lecture see you in next lecture if you are looking for teaching stuff education stuff programming series application and android development coding skills marketing skills presentation skill paid courses for free are available thank you for calling it up though